We're at the Impact Arena in Alfreton and the Bucks have secured a massive 1-0 win this evening against Alfreton Town in National League North and I've got manager Rob Edwards with me. Um, Rob, would I be too far away if I said probably all the elements that you'd be looking for came together in that performance tonight? Yeah, yeah, you're right, Which I think that was the best performance of the season really. I think all, all I simplified it completely. All I wanted to see from the players was fight, commitment and, and, and want, to, um, want to run and want to fight for the club, for the cause. And, um, and I thought they certainly did that tonight. It was really evident that the players were well up for it. Uh, they competed in every single individual 1v1 battle. Uh, the units were strong, and right the way from from Ben all the way up to um, the final subs that we that we used, and, and everyone, the whole squad was, was together, uh, unified, and, and that was really pleasing. Sure, um, goal from Marcus Denanger, obviously quite early on, gave you a, a long time to hold on to that, didn't he? Was that was that especially pleasing that you managed to s see that out for sort of like the best part of 75 yeah, minutes? Yeah, but I didn't feel like we were holding on either. I think, of course, there was, they're going to create one or two chances with Brennan Daniels' his left foot and, you know, they've got long throws so there's, there's going to be some balls coming in the box. We dealt with the majority of them very well and then relied on Ben to make a couple of yeah. saves and Bob Harris cleared one. Um, but, but other than that, I thought we were a real threat. I mean, we've missed another open goal like last week and, you know, to, to go to it, we've missed another few really good chances as well. So um, what was really pleasing is that we were creating them I thought, uh, again, you know, the front players caused them so many problems with their forward running and their speed. Um, and it'd been, been great if we'd have taken one or two more chances. So I didn't feel like we were holding on. I felt like we were the ones that were going to go on and get the second goal. Sure. Kane Richards' full debut this evening. Um, was that sort of the, the kind of performance that, you know, made you want to bring him into the club, what he delivered this evening? Yeah, of course. Um, we uh, we were delighted with him tonight. Uh, we had to manage him a little bit. He was just feeling his back slightly at half time, so um, he was still looking a real threat. I thought in the second half, but before we got too tired, we needed to make the change. But it's great that we've got John Mars and Jordan Murphy, you know, McAtee on the on the bench who, who can come on and and and, um, and affect the game as well. So um, really pleased with him. I thought he, can, he you know he locked the ball in well at times. He, he looked to combine. I thought he looked a real threat when he was running in behind. Um, so yeah, he'd be a real asset. Sure. There seemed to be a lot of control about that performance as well. I mean, I, I know you don't like to highlight individuals, but for me, I know Henry Cowan seemed to, to, to stand out in that, in that, you know, sensible, good use of the ball when he'd got it, keeping control of it. That, the same went for pretty much everybody, didn't it? Yeah, it, it did. Uh, you're right. Uh, but, you know, the spine, I thought, were excellent. You know, I thought the two centre-halves headed everything. Um, I thought that allowed then the two midfielders, Nellis and Henry, to really dictate and control at game in terms of second balls and with their quality as well and you're right I thought Henry's outstanding tonight that's his level that he needs to continue to play at um, but but that's everyone's level that he needs to continue to play at and that, it's um, it, it, it was it was a, a really um, not only solid performance you're right controlled aggressive at the right times and an and exciting performance as well because we, we looked a real threat going forward sure and now on to Darlington on Saturday yeah, yeah, it's going to be a really tough game. Had a tough battle up there earlier in the season um, when the weather was a little bit fairer, and um, you know, we'll be looking to take the same result. We know it's going to be tough, of course, and uh, we just need to try and get everyone behind the players. You know, you know, if everyone can get behind the players and support them, if they see them giving that, if the fans see them giving that, the commitment, the effort, that work rate, then they will. They'll get with them, and that'll that'll make things so much easier. And we need to try and build off this win. Um, but you know we have to show that fight, that commitment, and um, and particularly at home now because that's where you know that's your bread and butter. That's where you want to try and pick up the majority of your points. Uh, Darlington on a good run, you know, and they'll be full of confidence after the the weekend result as well. So uh, let's go, let's go again. We're looking forward to the challenge. Sure. Okay. Congratulations, performance tonight, Rob. Great. Thank you. Thank you. Well done.